Do you know in Vietnam, the textile and garment industry is one of the main export sectors and accounted for 50% of total GDP in 2013. The key products are shoes, t-shirts, shirts and sportwear. In Vietnam, t-shirts accounted for 20% of total revenue of the entire industry. One of the largest t-shirt manufacturers is Altum, a private company in Ho Chi Minh City, currently has 110 employees in two factories and one office. The company has two main customers including individuals and business. Let us show you how to make a t-shirt. Now is the time we point out the problems in the company's supply chain. Take a look at the dyeing house. When receiving the order, blank fabric could be shipped to the dye house with the color code. The problem is that the colors of the final product do not match with the requirement. We will suggest a three-step in visual color checking. First, after receiving the order, the supplier will dye one first sample and then it will be checked for the confirmation. Secondly, the first fabric bud will be dyed and it also requires the approval. And finally, the mass production will be started at the dyeing house. The second problem is that the company are using arbitrary set of rules, trial and error to forecast the mean. With that poorly inventory management, the company is facing a lot of backlogs in their production and cannot satisfy its customers. We suggest the company to apply material requirement planning system to the production plan why does it have? Because MRP begins with a schedule for finished goods, so it's what the company needs. It also have the company to balance supply and demand by answering three questions. What is needed, how much is needed, and when is needed. By that, the company can make customers happy and benefit a lot from it.